Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to get instant break hacks in Minecraft Windows 10 Edition. So first, you're going to want to start Minecraft, and then you're going to want to start Cheat Engine. Then you're going to want to open Minecraft in Cheat Engine, so you click this thing, hit the Processes tab, and go to Minecraft.Windows.exe. Press Open, and make sure it actually says Minecraft.Windows.exe at the top here. Then we're going to want to go to a world. And then we're going to scan for a float. So basically, we're going to scan for how much a block is broken. When it's not broken at all, it's at 0. And when it's completely broken, it's at a 1. So now, normally, we would scan for an exact value. But uh, we can't do that with zeros because it is extremely slow to do that in Cheat Engine. So I'm going to scan for an unknown value. And then I'm going to start punching a block. Uh, preferably something that's hard to break, like uh, iron with your fists. And then I'm going to use a hotkey to repeatedly scan for an increased value while I'm doing that. So I start breaking it, then I hold down the key that scans for increased. And just do that for a while. And then release the hotkey and stop mining. Then we're going to want to scan for decreased. And uh, we know it's 0, and since we've already narrowed down the results to only 18, we can scan for zero without it being extremely laggy while we do so. And then uh, scan for unchanged. And then start mining this, and then scan for increased. So here, we're left with two possible values that could be how much uh, the current block you're trying to break is broken. So what we have to do now is find out which one of these is actually the one that uh, tells us how much a block is broken. So we're going to start by freezing each one until we can't break a block. So I'm going to freeze this one first, and then I'm going to break blocks. I can still break blocks, so it's not this one. And uh, I'm going to try to freeze this one and see if I can break blocks. I can't break any blocks. So that means it is this one over here. I'm going to delete the other one and then unfreeze this. So now I'm going to right click it and then see what writes to this address. And then now you'll see when I start mining something, a new process pops up. And it constantly works while I'm still mining something. So I'm going to click on it and then show the disassembler. And then stop and close so we don't lag ourselves out. And then I'm going to go to tools here and then hit auto assemble and go to the template, and then hit AOB injection, that stands for Array of Bytes. And then, we're gonna want to register a new symbol, so you can uh, call it whatever you want. I'm gonna call it Instabreak. Uh, and then now we're gonna want to change this uh, mob SS to a regular move, and then make it float, and then 1, because 1 is a block that's completely broken. So I'm going to add this to the table now. And then uh, if we enable that, I can instantly break everything. 